Hello everybody, hello, I am back, back, back on this Sunday with another video for you, another video, video, video. So, we got the stuff down from the loft in the garage, and I want to show you a couple bins I have that, of my Halloween decorations. These are my, I believe these are my indoor decorations, so I'm going to show you what I got. Now this is stuff that I've bought, you know, over the years. Um, this one here I got from Family Dollar last year. I think it was like $5, I'm not sure. But it lights up. Um, some batteries. It takes three AAA, so let me see where I have my batteries. Double A, hang on a second. Okay, so I found my batteries. Okay, let's see. windows light up. It's pretty cool, pretty cool. Flickering, flickering, flickering lights. Even the pumpkins light up. And the moon. Look at the moon. The moon lights up too. It's pretty neat. I love it. So this was... I was in the right place at the right time with this. So... Pretty, pretty picture. Anyway, next up. I'm not sure these are going to be any good anymore. I used to put these on my windows in the my living room. They might still work. Double, double toil and trump trouble. Be back later. I told you I was sick. These are window clings. We all go a little mad sometimes. Then we have pick your poison. I don't know what I ever did with the uh, the paper that you put these back on. Another bee back later. I told you I was sick. Real e old. I knew this would happen. And more of the same. Okay, then I got... I wrapped a lot of my stuff because I didn't want it to break. This is my bat. I hope I took the batteries out of this. I believe I did. So it, the eyes light up in red and it makes bat noises and the arms and legs move so isn't he cute he's so cute super cute now a lot of these i showed in my video last year my halloween video last year um let's see This here is this lights up also. I got this from the Dollar Tree last year. It's got a like a crow at the top. All skulls. Um, I need a screwdriver for it, unfortunately. Let's see. Good thing I got one.
Don't you hate when they put screws inside of things? But I know they do it because With all this stuff I have, I gotta get stock and batteries. Okay, let's see. There we go. I have to make sure I had the batteries in right. Because there's times I don't put them in the right way, and well. I never remember what I wrap. Ah, this is a lighted. I remember this in my video last year. It's got a cat and a moon. And let's see. Now to get this open. This is one of those ones that is hard to open. Let's see if I can use this. There we go. And it takes a really small battery. I gotta. I don't even know what I did with the battery. I think it's in my drawer in the kitchen. I have to find it. So this is it. I have to look for that later. Anyway, next one. And I might as well save all the paper. I have to rewrap it all. This here, my mother-in-law got from Goodwill. Be honest, I don't know if it does anything. I think basically you just I think it put it on the table and like this or whatever. I don't know. It might have done something at one time or another. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know. So basically, it's just like decoration now. I don't even know where to put it. <laughs> it's right there for now. And then this is a pumpkin that you could put a candle in. Um, a tea light candle or you know the battery operated ones it's pretty cool it's pretty heavy too it's like goofy looking with the one tooth anyway so there's that This here, okay, so I gotta be careful with this. This broke on me last year. It literally was in like a glass bubble. And the glass bubble broke on me, so now I just have this. I mean, it's still, it's still a good decoration, but it was so cool with the glass around it. Oh, well. It's still, it's still a nice decoration. Okay, then. Look at my little crow. Isn't he cool? He glows in the dark. Well, he's supposed to glow in the dark anyway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
What are you guys doing? The cats are napping in here. I got Salem and Taylor. My room is like a mess right now because, well, I have the bins in here and all the paper all over the floor and I got laundry that I still have to fold that I just took out of the dryer. I've been using the dryer even though it's kind of making noises, but whatever. Anyway, oh, this guy's cool. This used to scare my oldest. I've had this for several years. I literally got this from Rite Aid. Um, I want to say like four years ago, I want to say. And I usually hang it on my oldest bedroom door. The eyes light up and it's like, let me out of here. Hello. You know, he has this crazy voice. And um, he was glued to this and he would like pull on the... I have to fix that, but whatever. Isn't he cool looking? <laughs> anyway, I wish I can like turn it on for you um, to hear, but it's kind of loud and you no, know, just like my skeleton in there. And if you're trying to fall asleep, it wouldn't be good. This here. This is a skull head I got from Dollar Tree. I don't know if it was last year or the year before. Um, I have two of these actually. Well, in this bin anyway, I probably have a lot more than this. Okay, then this here, um, he is actually missing his leg and his head. I don't know whatever happened to it. It's like my dragon. He's missing his leg and his head. I don't know what happened to it. But he was cute. I'm not sure where the rest of him is. And I haven't seen anything like that yet this year. So. This is really heavy. It's another decoration. It's really heavy. It's just the legs. So, interesting. I don't even know where to put it. I guess I could just stick it down there for a second. And then we have... Oh, yeah, I think my mother-in-law got this for my, my youngest, too. It's Frankenstein. So I think this was for my, my son, too. I'm just going to put it there. And then I have another crow. Isn't he cute? And let's see. Another apothecary shop, a cabinet of curiosities, tonic, potions, and antibiotics. So another sign that I got from Dollar Tree. And then, let's see. I'm oh, sorry. Look how cute this is. Pumpkins with a cat. We'll call that Salem. Looks like Salem. And then my three skulls. They still have these at the Dollar Tree. I saw them. I'm like, I think I have some at home. So, this is one. And I like how the eyes have glitter all in them. Okay, so I'm just going to stick all the paper in the bathroom. Sorry if it's too loud. I hope it's not too loud. Alright, 
there's more paper around, but I'm just gonna wait on that. And this here, I'm not sure where I got it. It could have been 7th Avenue. Um, it's missing an arm and a foot. I don't know what happened to it. It lights up two double, well, three AA batteries. Um, so it's a skeleton in a cage. Okay, so it's locked. That's good. I don't know if I have three AA. I mean, um, I don't even know how to get this open. Oh, so I was opening it the wrong way. Um, let me see if I can find some more batteries. I'll be right. Okay, I found three batteries. These are actually three of the batteries that I took out of the Halloween decorations last year. So, let's see if they still work. I had a whole bunch on my, um, my husband's tool cabinet in the garage. I don't know where they all went. Hopefully he didn't throw them away. All right, let's see. It still works. Awesomeness, awesomeness. Oh no. Okay. Check it out. Isn't that cool? You just hang it from like the ceiling or something. That's pretty cool. Okay, now, that's one bin empty. Now I'm going to empty the other one. This is a sign that I got from the Dollar Tree last year. Happy Halloween, please stop in for a spell. The witch's hat. A sheet metal witch's hat. And then I've had this for quite a few years. Um, I don't remember where I got this one. It could have been... I don't remember. I don't remember. I'll say it could have been like Rite Aid or something. But it's a dragon phone. Um, it lights up when you, I mean, when you like dial. It talks and stuff. My dad actually had to fix the handle. It broke off. My son was playing one at one time. My youngest and it broke it. So my dad did reglue that for me. So it's pretty cool. Next up, and it's got a dragon. I love dragons. Anyway, all right. This is for outdoor. This is my spider fence. I got it from the Dollar Tree. I have a whole bunch of this out in the garage, so this has to go back out. Uh, hopefully, we use it this year. I don't think we used it last year. Another one of them skulls. whole bunch of these that light up. So this is another pumpkin one I got. I started decorating my porch too. So I might do another video maybe tomorrow when it's less quiet because it's Sunday. Everybody's home so. And this here is a cauldron. I got it from somebody. Somebody gave it to me. You plug it in and the orange lights light up and like air air blows this up so it's pretty cool so I've had this for quite a few years um, this here lights up too I got this from Family Dollar I believe it 
was like five bucks. And you could take some it takes a double A and I don't know where they're at. So, um, so I have to look for more batteries. Yeah, double A battery. it up I don't want to lose the back okay but we have it lights up this is happy Halloween okay and then, uh, now it's actually solar powered too so all right crystal ball from the dollar store. I could use this as a craft also. Um, this one used to work. I used to push the button. This would light up and it would say something. Let's see what batteries this takes. It may not work anymore. Because I forgot to take the batteries out. So this might not work anymore. If it does, it'd be a miracle. But this is, I don't even know where I got this. It's super old, so. This here is a, a ghost that I used to hang in a tree, but it looks like it's, uh, let me see. I think it's inside out, actually. There we go. There we go. So, hang them in the trees. Got this at the Dollar Tree. So, that's another outdoor thing. See, I had stuff mixed in, or they could have just thrown it all in with my other stuff, so I don't know. I got a hand here. Do you need me to lend you a hand? <laughs> okay. Oh, this is pretty heavy. I hope this works this year. I made sure to wrap it up really good. Um, I got this, I want to say it was from Rite Aid. Somebody broke it on me and shipped. So, it's a radio. Whether or not it works this year, I don't know. Um, actually, no, I got it at Marshall's. It was $10 on clearance. It takes three triple D's. Okay, good. <laughs> See, it lights up. Isn't that cool? And it makes noise, so. Now. Okay, yeah, it makes noise, so I don't wanna mess with it right now, because like I said, if you're falling asleep, you wouldn't be falling asleep anymore if I put this on. Okay, so that's that one. I'm glad it works still after being dropped. Kind of adds to the the oldness, right? The crack. Anyway. This was part of a costume, a zombie costume that's in the garage. And this is a, you could put a tea light 
in it and it lights up. Okay, then I have no idea what this goes to. Some decoration. I have and the spider. Um, I could just put them anywhere, I guess. And then this is one of my outdoor solar lights. I don't know if it works anymore. It's like a couple years old, so I don't even know. But I got it from a dollar store, so it probably doesn't matter. These are solar skulls. Um, I'm just going to put them outside. Hopefully there's enough sun out there for them to get. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, so that is two bins of Halloween decorations that I have. I have more to go. Um, so I'm going to be doing another video in a little while showing you probably two more bins of Halloween decorations that I have that I've accumulated over the years. But that is it for this video, everybody. Until the next video, take care and bye for now.